Welcome back to Blind Bag Me. So when I was at Florida, which we did a vlog on, so I will post it in the icon right up here. Right up there. I, I found this shell and it completely reminded me of Tamatoa from Moana. This is what he looks like. And I was like, I'm gonna try to make this into Tamatoa. So I found this picture of one that like someone made out of cupcakes. But I was like, this is gonna be perfect. I could just like try to recreate this using Play-Doh. So to make this, you'll need, of course, a shell, different colors of Play-Doh, gold paint. I have some necklaces here, just to add like some bling to him. A paint and a paintbrush, and then some aluminum foil as like a filler for the Play-Doh. So let's get started. So I'm going to be crinkling aluminum foil to get it to the right size for his arms and legs. You can crinkle the claws. I found it easier not to, but I just loved crinkling it. Crinkling aluminum foil is so nice. Then I'm just going to be cutting that and into his legs. Now you will be seeing me mix red and blue to make a purple, covering the head in that light blue, then making a darker purple for the legs. And I have three legs on each side but one leg is just a piece because in the movie um maui said he ripped off one of the legs so i made sure to put that in now i'm going to be painting the shell in a quick coat of gold paint to make that nice then i'm going to be putting some spots on his claws and head i made some eyes and put um white dots on it covered his shell with all accessories like a shell and the necklaces glued on his legs and then he's done basically and i just covered his legs in sand okay and just like that tamatoa is done so this is how my finished tamatoa turned out i love his shell how it has like all the gold on it and I think the face looks like him. I mean, it's a little off compared to this one right here. But I still think it looks really cute. And I love how I put Maui's fish hook on it from the bracelet. I just think it adds like a really nice touch. And I love this sand because like on the bottom and on the like the seams where I glued everything, I just covered that in sand so you can't really tell it's like a line. Like it's where I glued. I think it turned out really good and I love the chains. So this is how it turned out. I guess I could have done can we recreate that, but this was just meant to be a DIY. So yeah, this is how he turned out. I think he's super cute. One of his legs is still drying, but thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video guys. Bye.